Adams International Airport once again and I'm walking along Corvalley Road in Christ Church. This is the old Corvalley. This is old Corvalley, which is best referred to as the old airport road. And it was good. Everyone had to use to get to the airport before there was an ABC highway. This is the ABC highway behind here. This section behind here is the highway. This is the secondary road to the airport. But this is the original road. So this is the road you will use to get to the airport if you're coming from places such as Oystings, or uh, the south coast of the island. Yeah, looking back at Corvalley Road. And the road to the left takes you back to the Granny Adams and Seabell Industrial Estate and back to the oil tank for the Barbers National Oil Company. This road can be best referred to as Highway 7. Highway 7 differs from the ABC Highway. Highway 7 is, there are, there are seven there are seven major highways in Barbados, major roads that we refer to as highways. Seven major roads, highway 1, the highway 7. Highway 1 is the road to the west coast into Spikestown. So, so, Highway 1 will be the road along the west coast, which is the parish of St. James, which, which comprises the parish of St. James and St. Peter. Along the west coast, that will be Highway 1. Highway 2 will be the route to St. Thomas via Warrens. And Highway 3 will be the route to St. Joseph. St. George, St. John. Highway 5 will be the route into St. Philip via 6 roads on Government Hill. Highway 6 will be the route to St. Patrick's and into St. Patrick's Christ Church into St. Philip. And Highway 7 will be the road to the airport. This is this road here. This main road I'm on. And behind here is the ABC Highway. This is all a part of the ABC Highway behind this house here. Where those cars are passing, that is all Charnox Road, which is also along the ABC Highway. Looking back to Corvalley Road. Again, I said this again, as I said before, this is the road to the airport via the south course. As places they place things, they are worthy. So, the ABC Highway is the fastest road to get to the airport instead of having to come along the South Coast. The South Coast Road is often filled with traffic, especially along Hastings, Worthy, and Hastings. It's often lively and active. Uh, lots of taxis and minibuses and so on traversing that route and lots of tourists and restaurants and so on along the south coast so that's what makes it more makes it longer to get to the airport so this is 
all the air ground other than industrial estate. Here we will come across the Barbet Agricultural Development and Marketing Corporation and Carlton Graphic. So the ABC Highway is much faster to get to the airport. <coughs> the ABC Highway started to commence construction sometime in the mid 80s, but it wasn't finished until 1989. It was when it was open. The ABC Highway was a visionary of the late Prime Minister Tom Adams, but he did not live to see it completed because he died four years before the highway was completed. He died in 1985, and the highway was completed in 1982. The road to the left is the road that will join the ABC Highway. The road straight ahead takes you back to the airport. The road to the right takes you to the Seabrook Industrial Estate and the site where the old airport was. That's the condition the road that meets back to the UBC Highway. Straight ahead is the airport. And this right turn here will take you back to the Seabrook Industrial Estate. And the site where the old airport was. These are all industrial estates at the airport. Again, the road back, the road to the right. Again, the road straight ahead will meet back to the ABC Highway. The road to the left takes you back to the old Corbley Road, and the road to the right takes you back to the airport. <coughs> and you can see the lighting power, the Seawell Generation Station for the Barbados Lighting Power, and these are the Generators here for the electric power company. The electric power is our country's main source of power here in Barbados. It was established in 1911. Even though it's not owned by the government, it is still the leading power source here in Barbados. The electric power company is situated along Bay Street. Which is the main artery into Bridgetown coming from the south coast of the island, just below the garrison, Starry area, and that's the score where have it is. So. All the Seabell Industrial Estate, the site where the old airport was before moving to its present location. On the Seabrook Industrial Estate. The airport was once Seabrook Airport before it was renamed the Grand Adams International Airport. Seabrook Airport was in, the, on this, in this area first until 1976 when it moved. It was in October 1976, I think it was. It moved to they move further up across the street, further across the street into a place called Spencer's, also in Christchurch. It moved to Spencer's in 1976 when it was renamed the Grand Adams International Airport. Brian Adams is a national hero here in Barbados, who was born in 1898 and died in 1971. He was the Premier of Barbados and the Prime Minister of the West Indies Federation. I mean the West, the Prime Minister of the West Indies, sorry. He was the Prime Minister of the West Indies and he was the Premier of Barbados. And he's also a national hero. His name is Sir Bradley Herbert Adams, and he is also the he was also the father of late Prime Minister Tom Adams as well. 
so the airport is named after the father on the wrong about just outside the airport is named after the son so this it was the site of the old airport here before it moved to its present location but this is what this is what wall is it was the old airport when it was Seawell airport until 1976 when it moved from this location into into Spencer's so this is now our airport. This is where our airport is now. This is Barbados' only port of entry by air. And it offers direct flights to destinations in the Eastern Caribbean, Central and South Central America, England, Canada, United States, and certain parts of Europe. This is the DHL plane part on the time out here. And this is the old airport site. I think it is now uh, the Apostol Company is in here. Aeropost or something like that. In here now. This is the site of the old airport. These are some planes parked on the tarmac. You can even see Virgin Atlantic on the tarmac part as well. And you can see the control tower for the airport. And this is the airport here. This is the site where the old airport was. I think it's now your post or something like that. Where the telly where the um where the post where a postal company I think a postal service is in here. No I think. They were post or something like that, but it was the site of the old airport when it was the Seawell Airport. You can see the control tower for the airport and this is the airport here. All right. We're now approaching St. Bartholomew's Church. This is the St. Bartholomew's Church Hall here. St. Bartholomew's Church was established in 1830. St. Bartholomew's is also a branch of the Anglican denomination here in Barbados. It's situated just outside of the airport exit. This is St. Bartholomew's Anglican Episcopal Church at Sewell Christ Church, just outside of the airport. Back on the airport road. The road to the left takes you back to Coverley and back to Oystens and the south coast. And the road to the right here leads back to the airport where I'm heading to now. Church Cemetery here. Referred as Saul G A I A. Our airport can be referred to as G A I A, like the Adams International Airport, or 
site, the former airport site, the control tower and so on. Yes guys, this is no approaching, I'm um, no approaching the Granny Adams International Airport. Tom Adams on the boat is just outside. And this is no this is where the ABC highway commences. The highway commences right here by the airport. This is the Tom, this is the control tower for the airport right here. And this is the Tom Adams on the boat. And the district opposite the airport will be Charnox. And Hope Field, where these big round balls are, these big white round balls, it's Hope Field, Hope Field, Christ Church. So, this is the airport exit here. This is the exit. And this is where the highway commences. The highway commences from here. And here, this is highway commences from here. And it would end. The rest of the boat is sponsored by the West India Biscuit Company, which is best referred as the Bisco. So the first cars are turning. Straight ahead will be where the ABC Highway commences. section of the ABC Highway. And it, is, and it is sponsored by West India Biscuit Company. This is our airport here. Valley Adams International Airport. This is where you come out, the cars come out. This is our new and improved modern day airport. Since then, major extensions were done to it. It was refurbished and remodeled several times. In 1985, sorry, and then again in 2007, and then it was being refurbished here the other day. But it look at its finish now because it seems open back. Southeast. 
Ronnie Adams International Airport. New and improved modern day airport. And next door to the airport will be the Barbers Concord Experience. Where the Concord is now house. It is the hangar for the Concord. Since the Concord no longer operates. All the guy on the airport. Which can be best first as GIA. BGI. Uh, Church and this is the airport control tower and this is our airport. That is the This is the only port of entry right here. showing the directions to get to and we'll come Barbados Concord Experience. Airport. And after this, beyond this point, we'll be entering the parish of St. Philip, which is southeast. You can also see the site where the horse. Yeah, yeah. 